South Dakota's congressional delegation is lobbying the U.S. Air Force to bring its newest fighter jet to Sioux Falls. Representative Christy Noem and Senators Mike Rounds and John Thune have sent a letter to the Secretary of the U.S. Air Force. They urged the Air Force to select Joe Foss Field as the next base for the F-35 Joint Strike Fighter. Their letter highlighted the accomplishments of the Sioux Falls-based Air National Guard 114th Fighter Wing. Both Noem and Thune said that the base had access to exceptional airspace and would provide the conditions needed to operate the aircraft. Joe Foss Field and the airmen and squadron there has been recognized nationally for doing their job with excellence. We have a great many assets to offer, uncongested airspace, access to uh, training at low altitude and supersonic speeds, 8,000 foot runways with cables, all the things that are necessary and all the infrastructure buildings out there that we think would really accommodate uh, the F-35 Joint Strike Fighter. The F-16 Falcon, seen here that the Air Force, uh, the Air Guard flies now, are almost three decades old. The Air Force will probably announce its basing decisions for the F-35 next year.